Can't you find or see the missed call call history on iPhone? Let's say you got a call, but you cannot see who's calling you because the missed call notification is missing from your lock screen and your home screen. If you ever see or face this problem, just try out this only advanced guide to solve your problem. Now, before you do anything else from your iPhone, the first thing that you have to do, you gotta turn up two important and the simple settings. First, swap down from the top here and turn up the low power mode and turn up to not disturb mode. Now, often these two things can actually make this problem happen on your iPhone. Now, after doing this process here, the next thing is just go ahead and follow the advanced process, okay? Now, the solution one, you gotta sync call through your iCloud accounts. For that, all you guys need to do here, you gotta open up your settings on your iPhone, then tap Apple ID here, scroll down, and find out the iCloud settings. Simply tap iCloud here. Now, once you come over here, get a tap Save to Cloud. Well, once you come over here, simply find out phone and FaceTime application. So make sure to turn it on. Now, if it's already turned on, all I recommend you guys to do just simply turn it off, wait for some time and turn it back on again. Solution two, you got to just show the preview for your missed call history. For that, you need to open up your settings one more time, scroll down, tap notifications, scroll down and find out the phone application. So make sure to enable the three settings first, lock screen, notification center and banner. After that, you have to scroll down and tap show preview and set it to always default. All right. So after that, just go ahead and take a look at it and see whether your problem is solved or not. So if you still have a problem, lastly, I highly recommend you guys to do a reset all settings on your iPhone to solve your problems. Now to do that, you have to just open up your settings, scroll down, tap general, scroll down, tap transfer and reset iPhone, tap reset and then tap reset all settings. Trust me, it will not delete any of your data, but it will only delete your Wi-Fi password. So if you're okay with it, just go ahead and reset your iPhone settings and it will get your settings back to default and it will solve your problems. And still, if you guys have any more questions to ask, please let me know in the comment section. 